Hi! Come to me, sweetheart! Lost Soul Zero Four saved. Alright, it didn't come with that before, but welcome back to One Late Night Deadline, my geeky guys and gals, and holy shit, my mouse is quick already. So as we left from the last part, uh, as we picked up from the last part, I mean. Wait, is that a seat? Is that a dude in there? I don't know. So we've, we've uh, met our friend in the neighbourhood, which... She didn't seem too happy, though, that I was in the office late at night. I mean, i got to get the work done, yo. It's the only way for me to be able to get my videos rendered and uploaded. Okay, I thought I heard something just then. Oh, I see you. Do you? Good. That's pretty damn good, because I got me a camera, so... I suppose everyone can see me right now. Shit, I better put some clothes on. Damn it. Ah, oh, I'll do that next time. You see me, do you? Oh, good for you. Is that both of these monitors that's going to do this? No. Alright then. Can we get through here? Probably not. Oh, we can! Sweet, I didn't know we could. Wait, is this the right office? That's a bad thing about this. I don't think the optimization's done right. Oh no, this is the same office we came in from the start of the game. Oh, super cool. Oh, I like that. I hope that's something that I'm going to be facing in the game. Right, I'm going to go upstairs and see if there's actually anything upstairs. Yeah, we're on floor three. So let's go up to fourth floor. And break the fourth wall. Hi, how are you doing? Doing good? Sweet. Why is that talking? Why is the elevator moving? That's gone. To, that's on the third floor. That is on the first floor. Okay. Says that that curtain's got something good to talk about. All right. This is proper spoops. Because in the demo, you never actually got to be able to experience the entire office complex. It was just that the one floor that you were on. And that was it. I only managed to get so far in the demo though. And then I just got stuck. Couldn't go any further, so I couldn't progress it. But then again, as I mentioned in the previous part, I never managed to get around to getting it rendered either, so... Yeah, have a fun. There's going to be a good few parallels which I can make from this, the full game, and the demo which I've played. But this is so cool. It's now a fully fledged building that you can explore to your heart's content until you die from it. That's another door over there. Can that be opened? It can. Oh, the fuck. Where the hell am I going now? Is there anybody down here? This looks like a fire escape. Oh! I didn't think that that door was open. I like. Just gotta show what I know, huh? Door. See what we got down here. Any deathness? Emergency exit. Nothing creeping under the stairs. Okay. Can we get some coffee while we're down here? We can. So let's refresh ourselves. Wait, what? Oh, I can go in here. What the fuck's this place? Uh, some generator room or something? I need a key. Okay. Is like, am I, am I going to lose power in this place? And I've got to make my way down here in the dark. Oh, fuck off, game. I thought you were going to be nice to me. Ooh. What is that? Oh, it's just a desk lamp. All right. What the hell? Oh, hi! Oh, I you didn't doing? know anyone was here this late. You, I'm alone. You all right there? You look like you got a bit of the shakes going on. You sure you're real? You ain't no I spooks? See anyone else around. Oh, okay. That's good. So the screen that we heard in part one is where we've got to go to the other office on the second floor. 
Well, now then. <laughs> You're creepy. You're like those freaking androids from Alien Isolation. Right, finally, let's go up to the second floor now, see what we can see. Oh, no, it's the same place. Ah, okay. This is the one. Hang in there, kitty. Yep, you do right just that. What the heck? Was that there before? Okay, who said that? Dude? Are you the same one? Where are you going? I'm gonna follow you. Did you go in there? No. This, yeah, this is. Have left their jacket behind. Hey. Maybe this person is still in the building. Oh, it's not my office, isn't it? No, it can't be, because then he wouldn't comment about that. I wonder if it's still got that same mechanic of hiding under the desk like it did in the demo. And it doesn't seem to be able to do so. Maybe it's on another disc. Aha, yeah, that just had to be open now, huh? I hear her knocks on the door. She's coming closer. A ghost or the devil in veil. That's the lady girl, all right. Used to be able to hide under the desks in the demo. Have they taken that out then? Uh, uh, okay, whatever. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh. Use hack disk. Okay. Shit, I should have memorized that, shouldn't I? Ah, crap. You can hide under here. Right, okay. Michelangelo. Alright. I knew there was something. Um, can you get up, please? Thank you. Michelangelo. There we go. So I just wasted a hard disk space for nothing. I should have realized that from the demo. But mind you, all it is is just a nonsense email anyway. Alright, so there's another dude just saying, help me. Where do you be? Where do you be, man? You in here? And nothing in the corridor at all. Bupkis. I mean, I do like the idea that it's now a fully fledged office, but you can see the end of the world. They should have really expanded on the scenery a little bit more. Put a bit more detail of something if they couldn't expand the actual gaming world. I don't know. But it just looks cheap to me, in all honesty. Not, that's not to say that the game itself is bad. Because, man, the, there's a few times that even the demo scared me. But I'm all used to this old horror game now. Oh! She's coming! She's coming! I'm gonna hide here. Alright, maybe not. What are you doing? It sounds like she's still over there. Alright, let's go out and see. Hi! Come to me, sweetheart! You're gonna kill me? Yeah, you're gonna kill me, aren't you? I can't move now. This is it. Death. I know, I just wanted to see whether it was the same kind of thing or not. And... I died. Alright. Luckily I kind of saved. I'll be back. Okie dokie, we are back. Back to the same place where we were before. Yeah, I know, dude. I'm a coming. She's in my head. Were you actually leading me somewhere then? So if I go through here... That ain't gonna close again. He's actually leading me somewhere. Because if she now comes in through here, I'm boned. Doors locked. 
since we make our way back downtown. And let's see if she's in Piersms. Hello? Where you be, princess? That computer's on. Did that do something? Maybe I just had to go back back to the uh, my office or the office that was in the demo. Nope, I can't do anything with you. Okay, so I've seen the email. I've seen the uh, whiteboard saying that she's coming. Are you going to be there now? Oh, princess! No, nope. just kick the chair all over the place. That's the same thing that happened on the demo, is the chair being flicked all over. Is there anything here? Whoa! Yeah! Funnily enough, I knew actually that was going to happen, but I didn't couldn't remember whether it was going to happen actually this early. The bad thing is I actually had to close everything again just so I can get through. But if I can get to floor 3 without any incident, I'm actually actually going to go and save. So I'm running a little bit short on time here. It certainly got its spook factor, and I really did enjoy playing the demo, but this one... Wait, is that someone new, or is that the same dude? I'm so tired. I need something to perk me up. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going. I don't know if I do that I just saw down there. Is the same guy that was doing the clean... No, because he had a different shirt on. She's somewhere. It's got that flicker flacker on the screen. Let's just save. Let's just hope she don't kill me while I'm having a cup of joe. So it now obviously means that because we've now got a big massive open office complex to explore, she can turn up anywhere in the building. Is she actually here? Ah, she's gone. She disappeared. Alright, well that's it. That's enough for this one, my geeky guys and gals. Saved the game. Getting a little bit of progress done. Died once already. Good start. But, I'm hoping, and I'm really hoping, that the story starts developing quickly. And it's not one of these slow build-up kind of things. Because if it is, it's not going to do well. I can see it's not going to do well for the channel at the very least. But when I did play the demo, I really did enjoy it. Probably mainly because with the demo, the developer wants to put as much as what he can put into that demo without giving too much of it away to say, oh, this is what my game is going to be all about, and this is the justification of the story. So, maybe that's why the demo was so good. I don't know. Oh, my brain's hurting with all the thinking. Oh, that's terrible. So anyway, my geeky guys and gals, if you liked it, you know what to do. Smack the like button. If you didn't, smack the dislike button. But if you do dislike, please give me a comment down below and let me know what, what I can do to improve the video and my speech just for you. And as always, if you want to know when the next video is coming out, smack the subscribe button down there and I'll see you in the next video. So bye-bye. For now. Oh, Wanna share a joke with me? Oh, it's the dirty, dastardly red balloon of death. Just gotta touch it. Hey. Gotta touch it. Whoa! Hi! Hi! Holy hell. Where are you? Oh fuck! Oh shit! No, 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 no. Vlogs. I've done so many vlogs recently on the channel. You really want to be seeing the gameplay videos. That I do know because the channel is a gameplay video. But there's going to be another vlog coming soon because I want me an iPad and I really want to show this beautiful beast off. So, yeah. Can't wait for that. It's a fucking gorgeous thing.